weekend, Steve and I traveled to the west side of Kauai to get a taste of the lifestyle there. Check it all out. Oh, take a look at that, Grace. Poi balls. <laughs> Everywhere we went to Kauai, everyone said you had to come to the Waimea Town Celebration. Yes, this is a 37th year in the making. Can you believe the story? with just a little bitty fun run, and now it's grown into this huge festival that goes on for eight days. Thousands of people come here from all over Hawaii. That's right. These guys are actually from the Big Island, and they're not raising money for themselves. Everybody has their own cause. These guys over here, they're raising money for Relay for Life. There's a number of Palau that are raising money for trips all kinds of stuff. We have one of the organizers here with us, Puni Patrick, and this has grown just into a huge thing, right? Absolutely. We've had visitors from Canada, Japan, Africa. It's been crazy. And it's completely selfless. They're raising money for other causes, right? Absolutely. So the West Kauai Business and Professional Association is always looking for ways to, you know, bring economic development to Waimea. And a lot of our community groups or organizations, when they're doing fundraisers at the same time, they're going to the same businesses. So that can be taxing on a small community. So they came up with the idea, let's throw one big fundraiser, have all of our organizations come, and everyone throws all their money in at one time. And it totally works. So not only does it benefit the community, but you get to eat the food. Are you going to try one? Yeah? One of the poi ball good? Yeah? Yeah. Uh, it's a constant theme. You're watching Sunrise on the Road in Kauai. We'll be right back. You're watching Hawaii News Now. I think that was like course number 15, and that was only around 11 a.m. Jen, unbelievable how much Steve was able to eat on this one trip over the weekend. Grace, it looks like you guys had a good time and definitely didn't go hungry, right? No. Oh. Not